What does it all mean? What's happening, film friends? Dave the Film Junkie here. All right. Another piece of the puzzle, guys. Good lord. But this is a beauty. This is definitely a beauty. I mean, they've all been damn beautiful. Um, especially, you know, the, the Jason Momoa Aquaman one, right? <laughs> no, but uh, this is uh, this is beautiful. And this just, uh, this actually got me pretty angry. I mean, I, I, I guess you could say this is uh, similar to, I, I felt pretty much the same when they showed the uh, Martha and Lois when he uh, posted that image as well, because it just showed you like, oh, what we got was reshot and added a lot of stupidity. And then, <sighs> same with this one. The cemetery scene. Yeah, turns out that uh, the entire league was there to retrieve Superman's body, as you can see right here. Look at that jacket. Look at that jacket Diana's wearing. I tell you what. I mean, same with uh, Arthur. They know they have some style, man. The Atlanteans and. The Amazonians, they got some style going on. You know, the other two just got some hoodies on, but, um, let me look, I mean, look at it. Dark, dare I say. Dark, somber, just, you could see a lot of emotion in here because they probably were filled with emotion. So instead of getting this scene right here, uh, by the way, Bruce is driving. Instead of getting this scene right here with the entire league retrieving the body because probably, you know, it's, hey, we got to get Superman back. It's, it's... We, we are not us without him. They need him. He's the final little piece of the puzzle. Instead of getting this probably pretty awesome scene right here, we got a Buffy the Vampire scene instead. Don't get me wrong. I do like the bonding between Barry and Victor. It's it's nice. It's not a terrible scene, but it, it just didn't make any goddamn sense because you have a character who's a who's a robot and could take turn his limbs into anything he wants it probably could turn it into a scoop dig it out then you got a man who is as fast as the speed of light or pretty damn close he's still fairly young but uh yeah so we got all that and it's just like man man they i mean it just really shows you that there was just an entirely different story here an entirely different story and uh yeah i mean when i first saw it i was going oh cool He's got a shot of these four, and then you look down, and you go, well, that's a casket, that's a headstone, holy shit, yes. They're at the cemetery, and uh, this was actually mentioned by Gal Gadot and Jason Momoa in an, in an early interview, uh, not an early interview, but one of the interviews when they were promoting the movie back in November, I, I think it was. Uh, first thing down below, I'll post it on the site. Basically, yeah, Jason Momoa was talking about, like, he said, like, one of his favorite scenes was uh, a scene that they deleted, and then even Gal Gadot says, oh yeah, I love that scene in the cemetery. The cemetery! Apparently Arthur had a flask and he offered a drink to Diana. That's another thing too. That's why I'm more angry about this one than uh, all the rest, because they totally completely wiped out, I mean, not completely, we still saw a little hint, uh, one little hint, I guess, when he brought that dude that he saved and he saw the green stuff and then he grabbed the bottle and he, you see him down it. But we totally missed out on the alcoholism of Arthur Curry because apparently he had a flask and he offers Diana a drink in this scene, according to that. Like I said, go watch that first thing down below. But uh, yeah, it's just like, ah, what is he going to post next? So then, of course, there's this little collage what does it all mean? Well, I got my top men working on it. We're trying to decipher this code, and by top men, I mean me. The image of Superman is definitely not Justice League Superman. I don't think. It doesn't look like the Superman. It looks like like it's uh, on the set of Man of Steel. It has to be, right? I don't know. Maybe not. I don't. It, it, I mean, the black and white kind of filters out. I don't. It doesn't look like his suit is like that shiny. I mean, it definitely looks like Man of Steel. And you have Arthur in the back of the truck, which was when I probably shortly after Bruce talked to him. And you have Barry and Iris. You got to wonder, is this all chronologically? But then you kind of go, well, there's no single pictures of uh, Victor. Even though he posted one like, you know, a while ago was showing the football, you know, showing him play football. But I don't know, man. It's like, is he trying to, uh, are you trying to drop a code? I don't know. There's some kind of fucking Easter eggs or whatnot. Who knows? Who knows? I'm going to do another video because a lot of people are talking about the 25th. They're talking about WonderCon. 
So I'll be doing a video about that. So look forward to that. I just wanted to touch bases on this and who knows what we're going to get tomorrow. I mean, over the weekend and you know, yesterday he posted, well, it was uh, his wife's birthday, which happy birthday, Deborah. God, man, he really scored with that one. Man, she is, she is a beautiful woman. Um, And then uh, he was posting you know, workout photos and stuff like that because the guy is truly Superman at times. Um, that's for damn sure. But uh, yeah, there you go, guys. <sighs> who knows what he's, uh, I don't know if he's trying to tell us something or he's just... You know, saying like, oh, it's about to come out or, you know, I want it to come out. Who knows? Who knows what's going on here? But maybe if people just start investigating each frame and seeing if there's something in there that is spelling out something, I'll probably start looking at it a lot more, too, now that we have six images. Preliminary thoughts about it down below, guys, or hit me up on Twitter. That's the best way to get in contact with me. I look at that more. If you have any theories or anything like that, just hit me up or you can send me an email, whatever, you know, hit me up. And uh, if you have any, you know, theories or whatnot, feel free to share them. And if it sounds really cool, I'll do a video and I'll definitely credit you. I am not one of those people that go like, I just came up with something. Nah, I don't do that. I, don't, I, tr I try not to do that. I try to credit people, you know, fan art, whatever. You know, if I know who, who made it or know whatever, I will say who did that. Anyways, guys, let me know your thoughts about it down below. Hit that like, thumbs up button if you'd be so kind. Subscribe to my channel. Visit filmjunkie.com for all my content. And, of course, visit the closet for merchandise. All right, guys? I'll talk to you later.